What's going on, y'all? Jimmy Mac from It's Time, episode 25, the season finale of season one of Community. 25 eps in. I have thoroughly enjoyed the show. And I have no doubts. We're about to get a very good episode. Very little doubt. It's only been like three mid episodes off the top of my fucking head. Jack Black, uh, 20. Two? There's another one. I can't quite remember. Anyway, don't forget to press the like button for the algorithm and subscribe. Let's get to it. Thanks for a great year. Mr. Winger! I hope you will be... Oh, this guy. Hello, good morning, howdy. <laughs> Wait, Jeff, I'll walk with you. Are we still dating? Pretty great. Not much could ruin today. Hi! Go! Banana Rhino. Yeah. <laughs> Banana Sam Elliott. Oh, no. So no. a real school? More like this. <laughs> Banana penis. <laughs> Child. Yeah, I gotta find a new place to live. My dad wants me to leave the nest so he feels less weird that his girlfriend is 20. You could live in a pyramid. <laughs> oh wait! Abed, your dorm room's got a bunk bed, right? Yep. Oh! Nothing? My friend Gary's transferring. Oh, good. Finally. Oh, I hope he transfers to hell. Damn. Britta Perry, it turns out, has been nominated for Transfer Queen. Oh, that's nice. What the hell is a Transfer Queen? Seriously. Don't let it upset you, Britta. It's the last day of the semester. Nothing can ruin that. Hi. Amazing. <laughs> it's like an evil genie. Shut up. Stop hating. Some folks say Transfer Formal isn't really rolling off the tongue, so we're just going to call it the... Tranny dance. <laughs> Much more green. <laughs> I too am a child. <laughs> Prom. Proms weren't even cool in high school. It's that kind of crap that made me drop out in the first place. You know, you don't actually have to lie on a sofa. Hey, welcome back. There are other more recent streaks that you may yet be able to wipe clear, like your adolescent fear of being a so-called blow-up doll. I really think this nomination may actually... <laughs> He listens to you talk for you, then recommends a makeover. Well, don't wear as much lipstick as you did on Valentine's Day. Your mouth looks like a coin purse. Jesus! Um, if you could help me... cheat my way through school. <laughs> How about I point out to you that we've never actually been friends, then laugh at your very well-deserved misfortune? Damn! Yeah. Sweet! You know what, Hefty? You probably don't want to talk to me. No. I miss you. Mm -mm. Yeah. Just take a picture to last longer. Cool. <laughs> Usually I tell her to go fuck herself, but she is really hot. I forget that we don't live together. Then I think, what if we live together? Oh. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna check in the other tag. Jesus. Why does our bit hate me? What are you kidding? Look at him. He probably hates America. Hey, babe. <laughs> yeah, oh, jeez. Sorry. What are you doing? Well, you had hair. I was gonna move. You were gonna move my hair? I don't know. Seeing as I'm nominated for queen, so true. Oh. I thought you were all into female empowerment. What's more empowering than a woman in a crown? <laughs> <laughs> I just did my first gag stand. <laughs> Show Shelby for purse is a really nice touch. Immediately old and out of place. No offense. Dancing in your underwear, taking air conditioner repair, so you can get a job. <laughs> Here's Hawthorne. <laughs> he made that up. Everyone remember to vote before the coronation, Tranny Queen. <laughs> for summer classes, which are a great way to, um, um, broaden your mind, have fun. The fuck? I'm not just going to Delaware for the summer. I'm transferring with Vaughn. What? Oh, shit. Well, for your and Vaughn's sake, I hope it works out. It's not. But on behalf of the rest of the group, I hope it's a catastrophe. Aww. He's a teacher, but wasn't actually a teacher, and he's now a student. Is there a word for that? Oh, if it was in Spanish, you wouldn't know, would you? <laughs> Hit a professor, he'll get expelled. Oh, shit. Britta, you look great. Such a stunning improvement. 
Oh shit! Must have taken all day. First thing you got, guys, guys, cleanest face ever. Hey, am I okay? <laughs> Me and Jeff and Rain Man and big boobs and medium boobs and black boobs. We're a family. What's your point? I've been looking at your situation. I'd like to make an offer. Okay. Am I black boobs? Wow. I thought we were friends. We are. Best friends. That's why we shouldn't be roommates. We'll end up fighting. Oh, and for the record, there was an episode of Happy Days where a guy literally jumped over a shark. And it was the best one. <laughs> that's an that's a inside baseball reference. Chip and Slater are getting back to get there. What? Aha! Uh -huh, and sight! Stop competing with her and start communicating with Jeff. She already mm. has a head start. They slept together. Ooh! Do you believe in soulmates? Oh. Um, okay, now don't be mad at me. I didn't <laughs> think that more than one person would answer oh. the ad. Yes. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? We're gonna miss you. Yeah, you're the one that didn't even want me in the study group. Come on, that's not true. Yeah, none of us did. <laughs> I say things others won't. I assume that you two were done since uh, <clears throat> Jeff and Britta did uh, the Yankee Doodle. Mm. Jenna Oliver's kind of a hater, huh? Jeff needs a girl who doesn't just not wear underwear because Oprah told her it would spice things up. He needs a girl who doesn't wear underwear because she hasn't done laundry in three weeks. <laughs> Britta Perry! Hey! I'm sorry. I have to go. I just won a contest for being hot. <laughs> Go ahead, Britta. Surprise to you, but I've never actually won anything before. Okay, well, I... you still have it. I'm just listing the nominees, so not a great time to get caught. Okay. Oh shit! Brittany Baker. Oh, poor Britta. I love you. What? Britta. Britta. Your lipstick looks better. What is going on? I'm really good for this episode, huh? Like, I'm trying to think, okay? Yeah, that's good. Like what? <clears throat> What's wrong with you? I'm sick. I don't know why. <laughs> this is not awkward at all. I have something to say. Jeff. I'm pregnant. Be pregnant. I love you. Do you have a patent on loving people? Would you like a patent on getting your ass kicked? Like a did did Okay, <laughs> okay. <laughs> And can you sit down, please? Tranny Queen is crazy. It's been a, a great year. I can't hear you. No one can hear you. I'm just gonna sneak right up here and give you that. <laughs> Go! I, I don't know. Oh. Uh, Come on, Jeffrey. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the beat in a rapping way. I got a real big penis and I drink lots of tea. Okay. 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 No, 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 no. You know who has a Dalmatian fetish? Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, well, that is a oversimplification, and you are suspended. Oh, come on. Oh. I'm so very disappointed. Finally started living in the moment, and I realized that in the moment, Greendale is where I belong. Oh. Back to who I really am. So, do you try to evolve? Or do you try to know what you are? Damn. Bars. Good lord. Only two pregnancy scares. I give this year a D. <laughs> I don't know any of these people. Royce, that was episode 25, the season finale of season one of Community. A really good episode to end a really good season. I enjoyed it quite a bit. The season I'm talking about now. And I really enjoyed this episode, at least 95% of it. Now, when Britta um, proclaimed her love for Jeff, it kind of felt hollow to me. I ain't gonna hold you. I, I don't really buy their chemistry all that much. I am sorry. Yeah, I think he has chemistry with the teacher, but she was an ass, so I wasn't really rooting for her. And then, once Andy walked up, I went, I know exactly where this is going. That's a solid conclusion to the season, but I cannot fight the grossness of it. <laughs> 
I don't mean gross in like a, uh, how do I say this properly? You know what? Here we go. I don't mean gross in a, this should be illegal kind of way. I don't even mean gross in a, this should be considered socially um, reprehensible kind of way. Like many people do. When you deal with like 30 and 4 year olds with 19 or 21 year olds. I don't, I don't. I don't uh, feel, at least not all the time. It varies from case to case. I only mean ill. Their dynamic, as said by Jeff, after the mid season finale, that's Jack Black episode, right? That's the Jack Black episode where he tells Jack Black's character that we don't, and he's really young, we try not to sexualize her. Isn't that Jeff that says that out loud? Did I invent that in my head? It's entirely possible. It's possible. I won't deny it. Yes. I feel like Jeff felt, essentially. And it's just gross to me. It just is. I mean, no, don't, I don't care how old she is in real life. I don't, I'm going to assume Jeff is 30, let's, let's go as low as we can, 31. And I'll go as high as I can for Annie, 21. It's not the age that's, a diff, that's, that's gross about it. It's, um, it's a dynamic. I really don't like it. I'm not a fan. I'm also not a fan of him and Britta. I guess I have to pick the teacher if I'm forced to pick. Hmm. That aside, uh, I really enjoyed this episode. <laughs> I really enjoyed this episode. The Dean again running away with everything. The Dalmatians was such an odd choice, and it worked somehow. I what? Uh, Pierce and Troy. Troy and Abed. I forget John Oliver's character name. He was fucking great this episode too. Him and Chang. Yeah, I really enjoyed that. I don't know where we go from here, but you all seem to think this season is ass. I like it, but most of you don't, apparently. It's only after after, after now that we get started. All right. I'm ready. Uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe. 